The flood zone tonight, folks in West Alton are still being encouraged to evacuate because of fears that levee won't hold. That's right, and Fox News' Kelly Hoskins, she's there live with how the levee is holding up so far. Kelly? Well, currently we are in the heart of West Alton and so far the levee is holding up, keeping the town dry. But we want to show you how the Missouri River continues to overflow as the shed is currently underwater and some roads and farmlands are also flooded. And we can show you some video as Bomberito Automotive Sky Fox flew over the West Alton area. We want to give you a better view of the flooding of the small community of about 500 people. The Mississippi and Missouri rivers which surround West Alton are still rising and authorities say a voluntary evacuation order is in effect. The levee district is performing constant checks of both levee systems to ensure that everything is in order. Meanwhile, officials are staying vigilant as they encourage residents to leave the area as a precaution. I don't want to give our residents and folks a, a false sense of security because this is still a very real threat. With the waters being towards the top of the levees, the longer that the water is up against the levee, the more saturated the levee gets, and that increases a chance of, of failure or a breach. So that can occur. And back out here live, volunteers spend a lot of time securing this levee. As you can see, it's a, lots of dirt and rocks in the Missouri River and the Mississippi River. They're expected to crest this weekend. So authorities say that the West Alton area, they are not in the clear as of yet. In West Alton, Kelly Hoskins, Fox 2 News. Thanks, Kelly.